my boy Halston Taylor, T A Y L O R, aka H T Lover. I came out here to compete, even though I was a little tired. Being a state champ, you just gotta keep going. I probably like the 40 the most, just because uh, I got a pretty powerful start. Come on, now, let's go. Get through, get through, run through it. Through. <laughs> what event do you want to improve on the most? Uh, my 40. And what kind of things do you do to train to improve your 40? Um, work on SAQ, you know, speed, agility, quickness, and um, try to eat right. I don't really get a good night's rest. I'd be lying to say I do. <laughs> but uh, when I come to work in the morning, I come to work out, there's always that little block you got to get past, and it's like, I don't feel like lifting, but I just go hard at it. The abs is just like the core to everything. Like, if you have your abs and you can move quick, left, right, forward, it just helps you. Off season, I eat vegetables, fruits, and uh, I try to eat as much as my mom can cook for me. You know, um, try not to eat outside food, you know, like fast food or anything. Before games and important uh, practices, I probably down like a whole freaking huge like bowl of like Alfredo <laughs> the night before, just because the carbs load you for the next day. When you get a chance to splurge on any meal you want, what would you eat? Psst. Um, man, I go to Panda Express. <laughs> Get the fried rice with the double orange chicken. I probably hit up McDonald's with my boy Will, get a strawberry shake. <laughs> and then it's back to work on Monday. Okay, what's it take to be a successful football player? Um, hard work and dedication, definitely. Definitely dedication. Football is probably the most emotional sport I've ever played. <laughs> Sometimes it has me about to break down, but I just I just keep going hard. I trust my coaches and I just do what I have to do and I trust in my team. Team!